Well, we're pumping, doing a pump down. This, let, let me just backtrack a bit. This is the system, the two, it's an MD23 system. We've got one tank on this side that's being fed, the fish are being fed a diet from land-based food. Um, all sorts of stuff, not fish pellets in other words. And the tank on the other side is getting regular fish pellet feed. So we're pumping this one down today for two reasons. One, we want to clean the tank. But secondly, we want to have a look and see just how much of the food they're eating that we're getting. That, sorry, just how much of the food that we're giving them that they're eating. And just yesterday, I, for the first time, I cooked some sweet potato and gave to them. And uh, it's so-called Hawaiian sweet potato. I don't know what that means, but it's a white flesh one. And it's quite good, lovely to eat, I don't know that much. So anyway, we can see some of the pieces down here. I'll just get some of them out so you can have a look. And this is what we're interested in finding, is just to find just exactly what they do eat. And I can see quite a few pieces left over here. And here we go, you can see them here. And you can see what's happened. I cut all these pieces after I cooked them in half. And you can see what's happened. They've eaten all the flesh out of it and left the skins. And I suppose that's to be expected. And that's a bit of a funny one. Look what they've done there. They've chewed around that and left some of the harder parts. So obviously they don't like it when it gets a bit hard. Perhaps I didn't cook it enough. I don't know. Yeah, that's quite hard actually. So there we go. That's an interesting part of the experiment. That piece they haven't touched at all. So maybe I need to cook it a lot more to get them to eat it. But look, we're finding, we're finding that they'll eat almost anything really in the vegetable field. They particularly like pumpkin. We cook up pumpkin for them all the time. And if we cook it enough, we've discovered they eat the skin and all. They'll eat everything. Uh, but here we go. This is the first experiment with sweet potato. So we gave them, I think it was 800 grams of sweet potato, that, that, uh, that was yesterday, uh, for their feed. And um, we'll weigh this what's left over to see what they actually did eat. Uh, but my guess is there's about 200 grams there. So, you know, they've had a good feed. That was yesterday's feed. So today we're going to give them more pumpkin. Uh, we've looked up pumpkin and carrots for today. I haven't weighed it yet, but it'll be about 800 grams again. So now it's summertime, we're trying to get a lot more feed into them so they can catch up and be equal to the other guys if possible. So that's all I have for you today, and that's about feeding our jade perch on land-based available food. You're just digging around the bottom of this tank, just as an add-on to what we just talked about. A couple of days ago, about four days ago, I gave them three peaches to eat, just to see if they'd eat the peaches. And look at that, peach seeds stripped clean. So they love peaches, isn't that good?